Hi everybody, it's Ileana Tony, aka The Prayer Princess. Welcome to The Prayer Princess channel. Today I am saying a prayer for anyone with um, what would be considered a lung disease. Well, um, what's on my heart to say about this is it doesn't matter if, you know, you contributed to this problem. Sometimes with COPD, there are different factors that went into this disease developing. Um, God does not care. He still wants you healed. He still wants you whole. He is the forgiver. He forgives us of our sins and any bad things that we have done to our bodies in the past. So do not let um, the enemy of guilt or condemnation or anything keep you from accepting this prayer and receiving um, your healing for any types of COPDs and um, any lung cancers even. You know, sometimes smoking is the reason behind those. And so don't let any guilt um, undermine you and keep you from receiving. Amen. And the next thing I want to say to you is be sure that you don't have any unforgiveness in your heart toward anyone because um, unforgiveness will hinder your prayer life. It will hinder your prayers from being heard and answered. The Lord said that if he's going to forgive our trespasses, we have to be careful to forgive other people that have trespassed against us. And then he talks about if um, you want to bring your gift to my altar then you be sure that you don't have any gripes and grudges, um, get anything straight with your brother. So clear it in your heart before we pray that you have an attitude of forgiveness toward anybody that has hurt you. Amen. So Father God, I come in your presence on behalf of anybody with any type of lung disease, whether it's asthma or COPD or influenza, pneumonia, any type of um, tuberculosis, it could be lung cancer, any breathing disorder, any breathing problem, any respiratory failure, Father God, I come in your presence thanking you that your word is true and that you are the healer. You told us to submit to your word and resist the devil and he would flee. We submit to the word of God that tells us that by the stripes of Christ Jesus, we are healed and by the stripes of Christ Jesus, we are whole. Father God, we sit to the, submit to the word of God that tells us that Jesus went about doing good and he healed all that were oppressed of the devil. We submit to the word of God that tells us that Christ Jesus said he's given us authority over serpents and scorpions and demons. You said in your word that we were to lay hands on the sick and they would recover. You told us, Father God, that we could use the name of your son to gain victory in our lives. And that's what we're doing today. In the name of Jesus, I come against this sickness, this lung disease, whether it's asthma, whatever the lung disease is, COPD, lung cancer, I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. And I command you to line yourself up with the word of God that says she or he is whole in the name of Jesus. Whoever is listening to this prayer, praying this prayer along with me and agreeing with me, whatever your symptom is, I want you to call it out now and tell it to go. Tell it to line up in the name of Jesus with the word of God. Use the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I command you to leave symptom. I command you to go. I bind and rebuke you in Jesus name. Thank you, Father God, that your word is true. You said it will not return void. You told us to receive our healing. You told us that if we would move the mountain out of our way and not doubt, then it would happen for us. So we stand in faith. I bind any fear. I bind any doubt. I bind any undermining of our faith that this problem is we brought it on ourselves or that God doesn't care or that God put this disease on us. You are a liar and the father of lies. We stand firm knowing that you've heard us and we thank you for the answer to this prayer in Jesus glorious name. Amen.